hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is Trisha and today guys I'll be talking about my first trimester pregnancy symptoms yes guys what I've been going through in the first trimester guys if you have not yet subscribed please hit that subscription button down below please like up the video guys gonna like it up already like up the video um comment share us out guys tell a friend to tell a friend about we are young family and guys watch the ads so guys i'll be talking to you guys about my first trimester pregnancy symptoms if you're seeing this video it means that we and i had announced our pregnancy um right now i'm eight weeks going on nine weeks pregnant so yes guys right now i'm still in my first trimester we would have announced that we are pregnant so now we would be over three months in the future if i get what i'm saying so guys let me know if you can tell if i'm pregnant i'm pregnant so baby mm -hmm. hey baby yes guys that's a pregnancy belly for you so guys today i'll be sharing my pregnancy symptoms because i want to help mothers out there i want to let you guys know that you know you're not the only one you're not weird other people are experiencing it too and some of the things that i do in order to limit you know some of my symptoms some of them cannot be um limited or corrected you know but you know i just want to, to share and we can converse <laughs> so guys let me start um this is my third pregnancy i've been pregnant twice before and i must say that every pregnancy is different with my first my baby girl she's in heaven right now with my first i did not experience any first trimester was the only symptom that I um, had experienced with my baby girl was um, smell aversion. I could not take the smell of certain food items, for example shrimps. So that was the only, only thing that I had experienced in my first um, pregnancy, right? I counted myself very lucky. <laughs> With my second pregnancy with baby Kai, um, it was a little bit different. I had a mild smell aversion, not much to talk about, and I had some fatigue, right? So I felt a little way, for want of a better word, in the first trimester. I just, you know, took it easy. But, you know, I wasn't, I wasn't sick, you understand? So for the first pregnancy and the second pregnancy, one thing that is similar to both of them, I didn't vomit. I know that a lot of pregnant women, you know, first trimester they can't keep those anything. That is the total opposite for me. So guys, for my third pregnancy, yes guys, um, the similarity is that I have smell aversion. Um, I would say adverse smell aversion. It's like, you know, I can't take the smell of certain things. You know, I have to ask Obi to help me out more in the kitchen because certain things is just, you know, I can't take the smell of stop a certain food. So, you know, preparing food is a no no. And that's the reason, guys, why you're not seeing me coming on cooking with Trisha on a daily basis anymore because I really just can't take the smell of certain of food. So, yes, guys, you're gonna get me. <laughs> So yes guys, smell aversion, another pregnancy symptom is taste, a change in my taste guys, guys my tongue, it come like you can't taste every single thing, even things when I did here. <laughs> so guys that was my, one of my first um, symptoms before I actually found out that I was pregnant, my taste guys, my taste. Guys, when I, I remember when we were at the hotel, I was pregnant then and I didn't know. And I was eating this um, vegetable. I don't remember the name because we don't have it often. I don't like, I, I was like, Leo. This vegetable, it's so spicy. It's so good. And it's like, nah, it just <laughs> So, yes, guys, my teeth buds are a little bit out of work, for want of a better word. And separate and apart from that, I realized that my it's getting better now, but 
in the earlier part of my pregnancy I realized that the top of my the roof of my gum not the gum roof of my mouth and the tip of my tongue it felt like you know and this was for about two weeks like I drank sorry something hot and it scorched right that's the feeling that I had for about two weeks it's getting better it's not back to normal but it's much much better so that's another pregnancy symptom guys let me know if you ever experienced anything like this before or am i weird so guys another pregnancy symptom is extreme tiredness yes guys i'm extremely tired with baby Kai, mm -mm, I wasn't like this. I wasn't so tired with my first, my baby girl. Mm -hmm, I was tired. I remember watching movies and I would just, you know, start the movie with Obi. And like in half an hour less, we start sleep. With this pregnancy, I have to get my little nap in the daytime. <laughs> Is, and guys, this is one other reason how we found out so hmm, probably I'm pregnant, you know, because guys, um, it was over the holidays and uh, you know, Obi is usually taking nap, not in a lie, if in the home, you know, I'm usually taking nap with baby guy. But me on the other hand, I find everything to do. I go on YouTube, watch up the lives and all these things. But I found myself resting with Obi and baby guy. And I'm this is weird right but you know i didn't think much of it because it was over the holidays and i was eating a lot of cake people and the cake have been some you know that thing but you know early pregnancy everybody do things when they're not supposed to do in early pregnancy because they just don't know right but yeah I really didn't think that <laughs> being that tired was as a result of that. So yes guys, extreme tiredness is um is another pregnancy symptom that I'm experiencing in my first trimester. Another symptom guys that I'm also experiencing is um either I'm extremely hot or I'm extremely cold. Yes guys, comment down below if you guys ever experienced something like that before. Guys, the heat on my body is unbelievable. Um, guys, I do a lot of cooking. I used to do a lot of lives, cooking lives, and you'd see me in the kitchen constantly complaining, saying, no sign in your hat. In the hat for two people, but it wasn't because of that. I was actually pregnant, and I didn't know guys um when i am in early pregnancy i usually i'm usually really really easily to sweat i remember with my first baby i would walk from point a to point b and i started sweating with baby kai before i even knew it you know i used to go to the gym you know people and i used to see you know by the time i start this says i start sweating and I'm you know but I wasn't doing anything more than I usually do right but I was sweating profusely and with this baby um, it's the same thing sweating profusely I'm not sweating now but when I'm in you know heated situation for example in the kitchen and all the stove them on and all of that you know, I found myself you know just sweating more right and i had to you know even change change outfit whilst i'm doing whilst i was doing that but that's one pregnancy symptom being extremely hot and another one guys is being extremely cold guys um you know the ac is in the room and the ac usually run from um the ac usually operates on like um 21 degrees i think celsius or something like that we're not really gonna quote to the people but it's usually on a particular setting but now it have to be like really really hot like 25 degrees or something like that or 26 because guys i'll be chilling like my heart will be fluttering because i'm that cold and always like it's normal right so that's the pregnancy symptom that i'm currently experiencing 
I never experienced anything like that before with either of my um, pregnancies. So that's a new one. So guys, another pregnancy symptom that I am experiencing, guys, is that I am consistently feeble. I am constantly hungry. Guys, it's like my belly can't hold up. But I eat more than all my human baby is. <laughs> Guys, two hours in the past, I'm just eating hungry again. Enough fear in the rain. It's like this rubbish of hunger. I know that, you know, in the first trimester, that a person can't keep down anything. I'm the opposite. I am really, really hungry. And guys, this is one of my pregnancy symptoms that I really, really dread. I don't like it, people. Yes, me love eat. Me love eat my big one. So guys, let me apologize. I lost the final clip for the video. But those were my six main pregnancy symptoms during my first trimester. Guys, please comment in the comment section. Let me know. Let me know if it is that you have been pregnant before. What were your pregnancy symptoms if you're pregnant now? What were your first trimester? Um, what is, sorry, your first trimester pregnancy symptoms? Guys, I hope this video has been informative um please remember to like up the video guys like it up leave me a thumbs up share me out thank you so much for tuning in with a treasure today until next time guys bye